So, last night EA dropped the 78 plus player picks. We have got World Cup Phenoms in packs and World Cup Icons. Hopefully, we can get ourselves some from 100 player picks. For cheap, fast and reliable foot coins, check out MMO EXP. There is a link down below and use the code HABER to get yourself 5% off all of your orders. All right, so 178 plus player picks. We are hoping for some World Cup Phenoms, some World Cup Icons. At the very worst, just some fodder. Uh, I actually haven't opened many of these. I've opened about five and my light just went out. I have no idea why. That is so freaky. I don't know what just happened. That was really, really weird. Um, but yeah, so I've opened about five and got nothing. I'm hoping that my luck can uh, increase, hopefully. Um, I just took Thorgan Hazard again. I have no idea why. Uh, in terms of the World Cup Phenoms, though, there are some pretty decent cards in packs. The one I care about the most, obviously, is uh, Leecher, Lissandra Martinez, uh, being a Man United ledger. I absolutely love him. I just think he's amazing. He's been such a revelation to Manchester United this season. Um, I think he's absolutely great. And hopefully, I can get him untradeable. That would be awesome because I did. I'm getting a lot of Thorgan Hazards right now. I did pick him up, but I'm hoping that we can, uh, we can get him untradeable. But obviously, there's Rafael Leao. Uh, Lataro Martinez, uh, Bakayo Saka, Adam Latau, Pedri, Bellingham, Kunde, Hakimi. Uh, there's some really good cards in packs right now. Um, who else we got? Rodrigo, Camavinga. Yeah, some nice cards. So fingers crossed we can get one or two of them. I'm hoping anyway. I don't know if they show like I don't know if there's like a show like sometimes there's an outline in the player picks if uh, you, you like you know early. I don't know if that's with these cards um there's also obviously world cup icons in packs so you've got the likes of lotha matthias lotha matthias i don't know how to say his first name i think it's lotha matthias um to name one i know there's, there's quite a few out there there's um suka haji dalglish lineker canavaro so you know they're also in packs that could be a pretty nice one to get to there could be some pretty nice pulls yeah so hopefully we can get something although they really haven't started off well we've had one walk out which was david alaba and that has been it so far they've not started out very well at all um the one of twos are also pretty underwhelming yeah like it takes a few months um probably around february march is when we start getting the one of three uh 78 plus one of three eighty plus those kind of player picks which are usually really exciting and pay out pretty well um and then team of the season is when we just get the really op player picks do you know the ones that you're literally getting a team of the season once every few player picks like it's worth doing loads of them that's when it gets exciting i still can't believe by the way that it's almost yeah why do they not take savage i can't believe it's almost like christmas this year felt like it's gone so quickly. Now, maybe it's because the game released a little bit later this year, at least in October. Um, I don't know, but it feels like this year has gone so quickly. I don't know. It's, it's a strange one. Um, it, but maybe it's the World Cup being in the winter. I'm not entirely sure what it is. But yeah, this, this year has just absolutely flown by. Um, hopefully, you're all having a good December and you're excited for you're excited for Christmas. I love Christmas. I absolutely love it. Um, I just really enjoy getting gifts for people. I enjoy seeing the, the, the look on their faces when they unwrap something that they really like, that kind of thing. Like, it's just like, I don't know, it's wholesome. Uh, it makes me feel warm inside. Uh, anyway, back to football. Harry Kane... Let the country down. No, I'm joking. Um, I was very disappointed, though. I did not think they would miss that penalty. But, you know, we've got Croatia, Argentina tonight. So, fingers crossed that... Uh, well, I, don't, I don't know how to feel, to be honest. Because as much as I want Croatia to do well, I'd love Croatia to win the World Cup. Um, or Morocco, for that matter. Um... I also kind of want Messi to win it. And I'm a Man United fan and I love Ronaldo. You can't see it, but I've got a Ronaldo shirt just down there. You can probably see the little number seven down there. I've got a Ronaldo shirt down there in a frame and things like that. I love Ronaldo to bits. But um, I think Messi is just the best footballer ever. And it'd be cool to see him win a World Cup. In his last World Cup, he's been phenomenal in this tournament as well. Okay, these are getting better, by the way. We're getting a few walkouts here and there. These are getting better. So I'm not entirely sure how to feel. Oh, back-to-back walkouts. These are actually getting quite spicy. Come on, let's get a blue. Let's get a phenom. No, we get Darwin, Darwin Nunes. Oh, my word. Okay, that uh, that guy on TikTok, by the way, is hilarious. The guy that makes the Darwin, the Darwin Nunes songs. Um, but, yeah, so, anyway. Back to the player picks. We've had a few walkouts. They have been all right, but we're yet to get a pretty decent special... Well, yeah, to get any special card, but we're yet to get any like anything exciting, really. I'm hoping we can get something. I would hate to go through 100 player picks and get absolutely nothing. That would suck. Going through 100 of them and getting nothing would be awful. Um, fingers crossed we can get something. What are we saying? We've got five left of the first 50. Oh, it's not looking good, is it? It's not looking good. Please, EA, sort us out. Oh, it's not looking good. I don't know if these phenoms are hard to pack or not. I don't think I have packed any. Oh, no, I've packed a couple. I have packed, I have packed one or two, but I don't know. Are they difficult to pack? 
Hey, well, they appear pretty difficult to pack. We get ourselves Robertson, not bad. Another 87 rated. We'll take all the fodder. The fodder is great for SBCs. But the first 50, no Phenom. Probably about six or seven walkouts. Not awful. Not the end of the world, but not great at all. All right, we have our second set of 50 now. Okay, not a bad start. Croatian player. Um, hopefully, this set is better. Fingers crossed. We are just looking out for one World Cup Phenom. That's all I want. I'm not even asking for a World Cup icon, although I did see someone get Matthias in one of these player picks, so that would be exciting. But I'm not... Okay, Marco Vray. Uh, you know, I just want to see a World Cup Phenom out of one of these, to be honest. That's all I want to see, EA. Just one World Cup Phenom. And it, and it be Lissandro. I'm not even asking for, like, Rafael Leal. I'm literally not even asking for the best one. I'm asking for Lissandro Martinez. He's, he's literally only worth about 170k, roughly, which is actually quite a lot. But, you know, he's not worth a million coins. I'm not asking for the best one. I shouldn't have taken Griezmann. I'm still pretty sore, I can't lie. I'm, I'm a little bit sour from that one. Um, I mean, to be honest, Griezmann was very good in that game, wasn't he? Um, he was very, very good. I, I, To be honest, the one thing I will say about that game, though, and, and this tournament in general, is how good is Jude Bellingham? Jude Bellingham is absolutely phenomenal. That boy is going to be so good. So good in his career. He's only 19, he's performing like that, and he's got, the, he's got such a smart head in his shoulders. Like, he is going to be... A special, special player in his career. Enough about that. Unless we pack him, I don't want to talk about it anymore. You know, I want to. I want to talk about the the phenom Lissandro Martinez. I'm about to pack. You know, and not Lotaro, Lissandro. Okay, I don't want some technicality here. Yeah, I want Lissandro. Please, can we please get one? Ah, oh, we get a perfect link to Lotaro, but it's just not what we want right now, is it? Take Kalulu. This isn't looking good. I, uh, I don't know if I've got... I just don't have a good feeling about it, to be honest. I did pack Dan James last night, but, you know, if I can get him again, I'd be quite happy. I just want to get one. Just one untradeable, really. I'm being greedy. I am being greedy, and I don't care. Go on, Luke Shaw. What a guy. What an absolute phenomenal left-back he is. Um, we can take Sinistera from Leeds. Come on, EA. Come on. You're getting a bit... Uh, we'll take a walkout. They're getting a bit stale now. You know, the walkout kind of makes it a little bit more exciting. Back-to-back -back walkouts. Okay. They're starting to spice up a little bit, but it, it, they are starting to get a bit stale at the same time. So, you know, Gavardio, by the way, what a player he is. He is a phenomenal centre-back. And Bo we're getting all the World Cup legends. Bo no has been fantastic in this World Cup. I'm pretty sure the only goal Morocco conceded was an own goal in this tournament. No? That's that is uh, that's Morocco as well. No one expected Morocco to get to the semi-final. That's crazy. Samuel Leto did, to be fair. But that's crazy, man. We'll take holes. Come on. Pelizier. Saw us out with a phenom before the end of these player picks. We've got, like, probably, like, 35 left or something like that. Like, please. Saw us out with a phenom. Actually, we don't have anywhere near 35 left. We've, got, we've got, probably got about 15 left. Please. Uh, Riyad Mahrez is at least an 86. It's not looking good, is it? Let me know in the comments down below, by the way, if you've packed one. I just, I'm just interested. If you guys packed one, I'm guessing some of you have packed probably many of them, to be honest. I'm, I'm seeing people get them in all sorts of packs. I'm not. I can't pack them to save my life, but I'm seeing a lot of people pack them. So, you know, let me know in the comments down below if uh, if you guys have packed them. Um, come on, EA. Sort us out, please. Oh, I just remembered as well. I need to go do the Enzo Fernandez SPC. Oh, please say it's still there. What time is it? Half four. It should still be there. I'll be shocked if it's not. I'm kind of rushing through these now because I'm a little bit nervous. I want to go complete the Enzo Fernandez SBC. I think that SBC is fantastic. I'm going to use all my fodder from these into it. Um, they are of Meccano. Again, don't really want to take French players, but uh, I will, I guess. Um, I think we're on to our last half page. All right, we've got six player picks left of the 100. We are still yet to get ourselves a World Cup Phenom. It's not looking great in that department, but we've had quite a lot of fodder. So I'm not too disappointed with the amount of fodder we've had. However... Yeah, it's, it's, it's not looking good in that department at the moment, is it? Come on, sort us out. Ooh, I'll tell you what, cheeky little Kalor Navas, the, the fodder, the fodder has been very, very good. The fodder has been very good. I cannot complain about the fodder, but, you know. All right, last player pick. Save us with a World Cup Phenom in the last one. The clutch player pick, we get Jamal Mazzioli. Probably should be a World Cup Phenom. I don't really know what the World Cup Phenoms are, but, like... You know, he's a young player and he's pretty good. Is that all the player picks? That is all the player picks. Now, the, the best players we've had were 88 rated walkouts. That is the best players we had. Um, Not ideal, to be honest. But, I don't know. I, I don't have anything. I've got nothing to say. Not ideal at all. All right, one way of the account now. We're going to do the hero pack, the packs in store, and also the quarterfinal nation pack that I didn't open previously. What we got in the quarterfinal nations pack? English striker 
All right, at least it's not Harry Kane. I don't know if I can take that right about now. Uh, Jamie Vardy. That's all right. All right, now it's time for the store packs. We've got the World Cup Phenom Essentials pack. We'll open this one first and see what we get. Uh, it's going to be a walkout. Go on, Mbappe. Why not? English. Okay. All right. EA. Woo. Okay, let's relax now. Um, I mean, it's okay. It's all right. What do we get in the in the icon player pick? I tell you what, Sammy Leto is a pretty good one to get. I mean, it's on loan, obviously, but I never see anyone getting the good ones. I always see like the same three rubbish ones. It's like Bobby Moore, Baggio, and Cassias. So we'll take it. Winter warm up pack now. Five hundred thief points. What we got? Hey, World Cup Phenom card. Let's go, Germany. Centre back Tilo Kara. I'll take it. It's an eighty-five rated. Too low, Kara, but at least we got one. I wanted to at least get one in this video. Uh, untradeable, but, you know, I mean, it's not going to get used in this account. I can't lie to you, but at least we got one. You know, that's the main thing. And, of course, I almost forgot the icon pack. See what I mean? That's the usual ones you get. Um, so, I'm quite happy with Samuelato. And now for the FIFA World Cup Phenom Foundations pack. What I, I don't even know. I'm just reading off what it says nowadays. Walk out. What we got? Dutch. Centre-back Van Dijk. Nice. 90-rated Van Dijk. Still worth a little bit, I think. Uh, I don't know if he's worth a huge amount. He is worth, like, 100k-ish. Not bad. And we get our World Cup loan pack, which is going to be... This Davos Suka card, by the way. I cannot believe how cheap this Davos Suka card actually is. I I think I'm alone in the fact that I think this card looks insane. Uh, like, this card's 80k. I don't know why. He, I feel like this card would be absolutely ridiculous, but... I, again, I feel like I'm alone in that. And I don't know why. Maybe just people enjoy that they're small, agile players. I don't know. So we've completed the FIFA World Cup Hero upgrade on this account. And I, of course, forgot as well that I have an 82 by 20 that I can complete on this account just from getting the tokens from the packs that we've opened on this account too. So 82 by 20 and the World Cup Hero pack. And I might be able to do the 87 plus base or mid icon pack if it's still there. If I get enough fodder. Don't know yet. We'll do the 82 by 20 first. Let's see what we get. Here we go. It's not going to be a phenom. It's going to be a normal walkout. It's going to be awful. Absolutely awful. No 87 plus for me. My word. That is two 86s. I mean, look, it's only an 82 plus, but that's still terrible. I'm just going to discard the rest. And we're going to open up the, um, the FIFA World Cup Hero Pack now. Here we go. Let's get a big hero. Why not? It's going to be Tim Cahill. Lovely. 88 rated. I might be able to do the World Cup icon pack. I'm going to go... Oh, sorry, the 87 plus icon pack. If it's still there. I'm going to quickly open up the ultimate packs now and see if we get something good from those. Sound. Another Van Dyke. I'll take that. What is Virgil actually worth? I'll happily take another Van Dyke. Uh, Big Verge is worth 93k. Solid. That has been our best pack pull from these ultimate packs. They really haven't been paying out, to be honest. But... At least we've got a Van Dyke. I'll take that. I can't believe that we've still got a gold card worth 93k. It feels like they're all worth nothing these days, bar Mbappe. So we'll take it. All that and the 87 plus icon pack isn't even out anymore. So there you go. That was pretty stupid from me. But we're going to end the video there. If you guys have enjoyed, please leave a like down below. Subscribe if you guys aren't around here. Thank you all for watching this video. And I'll see you later.